James, what do you think this really tells us? The fact that the House is leaderless, the fact that it was done because of a small fraction within the party, the far right being able to do this, what it really tells us just about the direction of the GOP and what we can expect to play out over the next 13 months until the 2024 election? Well, one of the things we always told that elections have consequences, uh, yeah. elections that have a narrow win <laughs> really have consequences. And, and remember, the Democrats had the same majority, plus four, that McCarthy had. And because of Pelosi's skill and just Democrats wanting to come together, we had nothing like these kinds of issues. And I, I, I think every most of the stuff that's that's there now, they raised money off of the cell phone and they sent out blast requests. And Matt Gates probably had his biggest fundraiser today. He doesn't care. Yeah, it's, it's how much you can be on social media. It, it, how much you can raise online. It, and we're trying to run a government where people are not terrorized by bad stories about them. Anything that that. that terrorized by the, their cell phones and how, how people are going to respond to it. And that's how this stuff ends up. Yeah, just as long as he's not doing that fundraising through Venmo. Um, you know, all the things considered here that we have to look forward to over the next year, where do you believe that in all of the conversation in and around Washington, Capitol Hill, where that will continue to move business leaders to want to place their own interests as well, because that that's one of the more kind of weighty parts of this that we continue to evaluate on a day in day out basis. The business leaders that are looking for some type of answers. Yeah, I, I, I say this in all sincerity. Everybody knows I'm a partisan Democrat. The only hope, if I'm a if you're a business leader and listen to this, the only hope there is for this country is the Democratic Party. You, you may not like that, or you may not like things about it, or you may say that they're, they're you know conflicted or anything you want. But given the current makeup of the Republican electorate, they, there's only one party in this country that e even is remotely possible of producing sanity. And I, I really mean that. Being it is a partisan, but if you look at where they are, the composition of the voters and the people that make up respective political parties, if you're a business leader, are you somebody that sees a you know, country kind of moving forward together and that kind of stuff? That's the only hope you have. I'm sorry. I, Sorry to bring the bad news to you.